Okay. Hi guys. Hi guys. Um, hi, it's me, Lani. Um, I just want to, if this video isn't like the best resolution, I want to apologize. This is being filmed off a of Samsung phone. They have good cameras, by the way. They have decent cameras, but it's not off my, my Canon. I left my Canon at my apartment. So unfortunately, um, I had to just work with what I had. Um, I could have just done the video on an, another time, but I thought, let me do it when I feel, um, when I feel passionate about the issue. So basically, you know, I don't, I'd never thought like, at this point in my life, I never thought I'd be doing a video like this. I thought it would be behind me. But something that I've learned um, about me in particular is when I hold things in, when I keep things inside, I just, it eats at me. And I feel like there's a lot of things I want to address, yeah? Now, I don't necessarily feel like the whole freaking UK or the whole of people that watch Shane Bar and all this good stuff. By the way, I'm in my sister's bedroom. Oh, my God, those are her knickers. <laughs> I don't, like like I said, I don't feel like the whole of the UK or the whole, the whole of the Shade Borough or every black person is checks for every little single thing I do um, unless they're like a, like a big supporter. But even whether they do or not, I personally, I feel, I, even if people don't clock stuff, I still feel shame, if that makes sense. Even if people don't clock it, I feel shame because I clocked it. And I still feel in my back of my head how many people have clocked it but not told me. So I'm going to get straight to it. So first, first, and, for, um, first and foremost, I'm going to talk about the things I'm going to talk about in this video. So I'm going to address um, the end of a friendship for me with um, Miss Dems. I'm going to address my relationship with Castillo. And the reason I'm going to address all these relationships today is because... Um, they're eating at me. Simple as this. Eating at me, it's affecting, it's affecting, it's affecting me. So I'm going to address it, I'm going to put it out there. And I don't necessarily want a back and forth. I don't necessarily um, want anybody to reply, to reply to me, um, at all. Um, yeah, um, it can just end here. But I just need to say my two piece. It's kind of, I'm just kind of trying to, I'm, I'm kind of letting it go. I'm letting my feelings go. I'm letting go of them. I just want them to go into the air. I also want to say this. I really don't give a, I don't give a, what anybody thinks of this video. Yeah. You don't know how I feel. You don't know what I, how, it, yeah, you just don't, you just never get it. So I don't care. To be honest, if you don't want to watch the video, don't watch the video. If you don't want to support the video, don't support the video. It has, I don't, I don't, I don't care. I don't care. So first, and, um, f first, first and far, far most, I do not dislike or hate anybody I'm talking about. This is just ther therapy for me. I just need to talk. I need to lay out. It's been sitting on my heart and, and, and laying heavy with me um, for months, weeks, and most importantly, to, I think yesterday was like the point where it really just like affected me big time. So, um, I always feel like in life I get the short end of the stick. I don't feel like I get the same support as I put out. And that's fine. It is what it is. You get me. Like I'm strong in it. Like, like I'm strong. But, um, I want to make something very clear, like. The title of this video is I have no friends. I have no industry friends. I'm going to be so real with you. Um, that doesn't mean I can never ever make any. But at, at the moment, if you're, if you're talking about like people that actually got Lani, I don't have nobody. I have nobody. Like you've seen me collab with people. The only person I would say, like the only one that I could even say is the closest thing that has me is Blanco. But everyone else, I don't have no industry friends. Nobody has me. And that's okay. That's okay. It is what it is. Sorry. Um, so what I mean by that, right? So I'm going to talk about specific things that have hurt me in the past. And it is what it is. Like I said, I'm strong. It's not that deep. We move. But I'm going to start here. Part of the reason 
um okay so you guys might not know this but for a very long time i've been a little bit i'm not gonna say i don't want to use the word hurt but i've been a, i felt a little bit stung that, that's the best way to put it like i wasn't hurt or depressed but i felt a little bit stung by ivd the reason i never spoke about it is actually out of respect for demi yeah because that was my girl that was my bitch and because that was her that was her friend um i wanted to be respectful of her so i thought even though she stung you, you'll get over it. Now, nobody in this video owes me anything. And that's something I've learned. Like, you have to, like, move. Like, you have to you have to be your own friend. Like, you can't expect nothing from nobody. No loyalty from nobody is what it is. So, I'm going to just start by saying, yeah. Um, um, me and Ivy D were never friends like that. But... They so they so they so they just so much like I, I I start talking and I remember something so yeah cool me and Ivy Lee were never friends but we we followed each other um I think the first time we ever spoke I had DM'd her about her content this is before she blew before rumors um I DM'd her about her content and she like I showed her support she ended up following me and then I ended up following her back then she invited me to the rumors video shoot if you watch rumors I'm in it and then um I respected her. I definitely respected her and then after that that happened um um what do you call it I, I feel like i was also cool with renee so then what happened this is this i've spoken about this before but i'm gonna get into it i was also cool with renee and um renee invited me to her music video you know um what's that video um Woyoy. And I went to Renee's video and um, when I got there, like I learned, obviously there was a little diss to Ivy D. And then I thought, oh my God, like, fuck, like, I'm, oh, I shouldn't swear, YouTube doesn't like that. But I kind of panicked. I was like, oh my God, I'm in the, I'm in the, what do I do? She's going to see this and she's she going to think I know. But then at the same time, I don't really have, in, in, my, in my head, I'm telling myself, you don't have the right to, because it's not your beef. You, you don't really have the right to go and just, spill everything to ivd before the video comes out and give her a, a big heads up in the sense that you and ivd are not actually best friends and you and Re you me and renee and me and ivd's friendship was on the same level like the same level we were kind of acquaintances so in my head i'm like you don't really have the right to stir it's not really your business mind your business like she invited you here she's given you an olive branch mind your business but then I kind of felt this, I don't know why, I felt this loyalty to her. So then I re I told her, uh, so um, Renee's manager told me, he would tell me the day before. So I, I explained how I felt to him. I basically explained that I felt like, um, I, I explained that I was in her video and I just felt like she's going to think I'm a snake. And he said he's going to give me a heads up like the day before. And um, the video comes out. He never did, by the way, but he told me he would. And I could tell, I could give um, Ivy D a heads up. And I thought even though we're not close, it's the least I could do. So don't get me wrong, I don't I don't know how you guys would have handled it, but I feel like I tried. That's the point. Like for somebody who I wasn't close to, I feel like I tried. I gave her the benefit of the doubt. I didn't necessarily take sides, but I, I I kind of gave her a heads up. She said thank you for giving me a heads up, Lani, and that was it. Now we're gonna fast forward to Tion, yeah. Oh, I just want to say one more thing, yeah. In that situation, I basically picked IBD side. If you if you really deep it, because I should have just minded my business. Um, but I picked her side and why did I do that? I just feel like a fool. I feel like a fool for picking her side. Why did I do that? I didn't, I didn't have to say she, um, anything to her. Why was I trying to be nice to her? Um, I should have just kept my mouth shut. I like, I feel like an idiot. Like, especially like what, what, what? I should have just minded my business. I feel like I, I, I sided more with, with, with IBD than Renee in that. I didn't even I didn't even like promote the song when the song came out Woyo because I felt because I was thinking about IVD I wasn't even posting the song like that and I didn't really owe anybody anything but I just took IVD side why did I do that so anyway I thought it was the right thing to do at the time I'm obviously stupid because when I outed um Tion for what he did IVD unfollowed me um she didn't even stay neutral she didn't even just stay in the middle she just unfollowed me. So why was I a fool? I was over here bum licking a, a person that... <sighs> so today I like slid... I'm not going to lie to you guys. I slid into Renee's DMs. And I said, 
I'm sorry because why did I do that? Who did I think? What? Well, what did I think I was doing? So I said I'm sorry, Renee, because I actually took that girl's side. Like in theory, why did I do that? I should just mind my business because she just unfollowed me. She didn't even give me a nice little message like Lani. I don't want to take sides, but you know, like I'm in the music industry. She didn't give me any message. She just unfollowed me, and that kind of stung me. It didn't like proper her, but kind of stung me. Anyway, I'm gonna move to Demi, yeah. Um, Demi's been on my channel. I thought Demi was such a lovely girl. I'm not saying she's not, yeah. I don't have a problem with Demi, but she's hurt me. And so, with Demi, yeah, she invited me to her home. I probably loved Demi, yeah. But she invited me to her home. We've done videos together. I've taken all the videos off my, my channel. I opened up to her, she opened up to me. One of the things she opened up to me was her beef with, not beef necessarily, but she fell out with this girl called Nini. Now, I want to make something very clear to you guys. I am also, I was also cool with Nini. I was cool with Nini. But what happened is when they went to buy and I saw how Nini was talking about um, Demi, I didn't like it. My, my spirit didn't sit well, it didn't sit well with my spirit. So I thought, why are you talking about her so aggressively? And why you, you just sound, you, she just didn't sound, it just, it didn't, it didn't look good, um, in my opinion at the time. I just thought, why are you doing this? But for the longest time I told myself, but Lani, you wasn't there. You wasn't there, you have no right to judge. So I told myself, do not, um, take a side. Check on both of them, but don't take a side too much because you don't know the truth. But then in the end, like, Demi was so hurt by, um, by 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 nini who like i said i'm cool with guys i was in nini's music video as well nini's been on my channel that video never come, came out unfortunately because i lost the sd card but nini nini sorry nini came to my house she's been to my home the home i'm in now my family home she's been here to film a video with me it was a group video nini's been on the phone to me nini's talked to me for hours so i had a relationship with I've, in fact i'm gonna be real with you i was a bit, bit closer to nini than i was to demi but i knew demi first and I also thought like in, in at the time I thought like Nini was in the wrong. So I took um Demi's side. So um I, I took Demi's side but I didn't want to unfollow Nini because it, it wasn't my battle and I didn't actually know what happened. I shouldn't have I, I had no right. I had no right to unfollow her, but I wanted to be supportive to Demi. So in a way I kind of wanted to be neutral. I knew that I wouldn't hang because they were beefing, I didn't want to hang openly hang out with Nini necessarily but I didn't want to unfollow her when it looked like I'm to totally taking Demi's side when I don't know the full story so in that situation I just I, I um Demi was quite her she was on the phone to me she's proper open up to me about the Nini Dubai situation cool so I Demi made it very clear like if Pete if, if because she doesn't she, she doesn't f with Nini like Nini and her friends so what she what she doesn't want is um she just can't trust anybody that's affiliated with the girl. So then I had um, I had a decision to make. So um, really, um, I was closer to... I'm, I'm going to be real with you guys. I was closer to Nini. But because I assessed the situation, I thought that Nini is the, is the bad guy, essentially. And um, I think Demi is, has done less bad in this situation. And I felt sorry for Demi. I cut off Nini and I ended up blocking Nini. And what happened is Nini done her own video, la 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 la, talking about the situation. And Nini ended up even dragging me. Nini and um, Jade Black would, would randomly bring me up, talk crap about me. So basically, I put myself in the forefront for her. And I felt like I was a good friend to Demi. But then what happened is um, the other day, literally at the GRM gala, um, and Demi knows this, she's, has Tion's arm around her, and I felt like I had egg on my face. I actually, like, my problem isn't that people want to be around him or whatever, but I would appreciate, like, respect, like, a heads up. I would appreciate her to tell me, just keep me in the loop. I didn't get any of that. I would even appreciate... Why did she? I blocked Nini for her. I blocked Nini for her. And she thought no way to have his arm around her. I blocked Nini for her. 
so I'm, I'm gonna be so real with you i don't i don't care what anybody thinks of me it is over for me and the girl I'm, i don't wish her bad i don't think she's a bad person but we our, our star is not meant to be aligned so i've blocked her removed her videos it is what it is the least she could have done was just tell me she did but she didn't she didn't tell me she didn't tell me i i feel like a fool my heart aches a little bit i feel like a fool i blocked the girl for you the, the, Do I think any of these people are bad people? Not necessarily. I just think they're doing what they need to do. I'm going to be so real. Because Nini's probably going to watch this. I owe you an apology. I owe, I'm actually owe you an apology. Because why did I do that? Oh, I took her side. And she just to Nini that I blocked that I blocked you um I just want to apologize I thought I I thought I was doing the right thing I thought you were out of order I'm not saying you was or you wasn't I wasn't there but I should have been neutral because when IVD wasn't neutral I felt a type of way and I was actually your friend so if I hurt you by not being neutral I apologize because now I have egg on my face because I chose someone's side and the minute they get around Tion they're, they, they're best friends of him. She didn't even consider my feelings. She didn't even consider my feelings. So, I'm sorry. I'm so, so sorry. I don't want to be in the pasa, Nini. I don't want you to call me to talk about this issue if you want to. I don't want to be in the mix-up. I want to be by myself. I want to roll on my ones. I'm, re I'm not going to lie. I've reached out to Renee. I feel like. I just shouldn't have picked a side with Renee either. I shouldn't have picked a side with this situation. I kept picking the. I feel like I look. Look how everyone's treated me. I pick. I obviously, I'm a really shit judge of character because look how they've treated me. So I just feel like I've got egg on my face. I don't even want them to respond. I don't want beef. I'm just trying to let you guys know. I've removed the, like I'm trying to let you guys know moving forward. I don't have no industry friends. If you see them with my man, it has nothing to do with me because we're not cool. We're not friends. Do you understand? We're not friends. We're not cool. So if you see them on Shade Barra, you see them wherever, I'm good. Like, I'm so good. Like, I don't care. Because that person obviously ain't my friend and never was. The only person that really, really gives it ever about me is Blanco. I'm going to be so real with you and I'm good with that. Um, Finally, um, I'm just going to end because I want to make this fair. Um... The last person I want to talk about, because I'm going to let, these are things that eat at me. The last thing I want to say is, I used to be really, 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 really close. and had a very good relationship with Castillo. Um, I did not, by the way, I did not, um, with Castillo it's a, bit, it's a bit different. I still care for Castillo and I still love him to a certain degree. But the problem with me and my Castillo's friendship is his op, excuse me, sorry. His op is my, um, his op, unfortunately, is my, one of the people that I'm closest to. So he's fallen out with Trend Central. 
yeah um Chen Chen will do a lot for me Andy does a lot for me the F with me I'm not saying it's okay whatever I, the passes they have unfortunately for me Chen Chen will F with me heavy so what happened is me and Castillo don't we don't talk and I feel like it's to do with that in addition to that Castillo Castillo um when he was beefing Andy I know he mentioned Mark to Andy he said something along the lines of does Mark know what you're what you're doing like when he when he confronted Andy he asked Andy does Mark know what you're doing does Mark know that you've got a video on him coming out and I kind of just felt like why why are you even bringing up Mark why is Mark even on the tip of your tongue Mark is awful Mark leaks my my things like what we're we talking about so for me personally I, I I just I didn't love that I'll be real I didn't love that and um it's been the whole the whole situation unfortunately isn't the best um but like I said I don't um it's different for Castillo because Castillo situation isn't necessarily in my opinion selfish i just feel like castillo was going for a lot he didn't want that video to come out so he had his own mix up with um trend central and unfortunately again i feel like i had to pick a side um but the problem is i genuinely ha I, I was like this with him so i still love him i still want him to do well I'm going to be real. Even me saying this is kind of sneaky to Chen Central. I'm, I'm going to be so real with you. Because I love Andy. Like, so, it's like, who do you love, Lani? You know, it's it's not nice. Um, I love, I love, uh, you know, I love you, Castillo. I'm so proud of you. I see you all the time. I, like, I see, I see you get millions of views. I told you you can do it. I love you, but you're beefing Andy. And Andy helps me. Um, I don't hate you. I don't like the fact that you you keep dismissing the fact that I don't f with Mark. If you were my friend, you wouldn't you wouldn't talk about Mark. I just felt like you wasn't my friend then, like because you spoke about that guy and you know what that guy did to me. So I'm happy for you. I'm proud of you. Um, you're cheerleader from afar. I'm your cheerleader from afar. My sister was watching. Sorry, but I love Casino. You know, but I'm just gonna summarize this by saying this. Um. I'm gonna keep doing me. God's got me. Um, I don't hate anybody I've spoken about. It's not it's not a beef thing. I just need to let my feelings out and let you guys know just know how I felt. I don't like what like I don't owe anyone anything. People don't think about me. People don't think about me. People don't think about me. I don't owe nobody no nothing. So I'm just here to talk my piece. Do you get it? Talk my piece. Nobody I, I, these people don't these people don't think about me, so I'm not gonna think about them. It's calm. Everyone's blocked. I've removed every video from my channel. We ha I have no affiliation. Not not with Castillo. I'm just keeping that video because I I still ca care for him. But everyone else, I've removed the videos. I don't want no association with you. I'm I'm so sorry, Nini. I'm sorry to Renee. I've spoken to Renee. And we move. We move. It's not. It's not a. It's not a. Um. It's not a back and forth thing. I just don't. They're not my favourite people. And that's okay. And it is what it is. Goodbye and good night. Surfer. Boing, boing, boing. Tease on your tongue like an ice cream.